Hi everyone, it's Miss Cervantes here, and today in this video we're going to make a fort out of blankets. So I'm going to show you two ways that you can make this fort. This is going to be the first way. You can pick either way um, that's easier for you or that's more convenient to where you live. These spaces are not only fun to make, but they're also great for a place to study, to listen to music, and to just watch some TV and have some alone time. So the supplies you're going to need for this project are some bed sheets, blankets, pillows, lots and lots of pillows. So go ahead and try to find as many pillows as you can around your house, but make sure you have permission to use them before you do. You're also going to need rope, but I didn't have any rope, so I'm going to be using some old clothes that I tied together. And then you're going to need these clips, any clips that you can find, or clothes pins to hold the tent together. So I started off by tying my clothes rope to the top of my curtain rod, and I stretched it all the way across down to the other side of my room and I tied it to the end of my clothes dresser and you can see I tied just use some old clothes to tie and make my rope since I didn't have any in my house. So for the first step we're going to take our bed sheet, unfold it and then you're going to place it over the rope or the clothes rope that you have and start stretching it out to make your tent shape. Then you're gonna use either your clip or your clothespin to secure it uh, right on top so it doesn't fall. Next, you're gonna take your pillows and place them on the sides, both sides of the tent, and tuck the sheets underneath the pillows so they stay in place and they make a nice open space on the inside of your tent. Once you've done that, just go ahead and grab your blankets and any extra pillows that you have and place them on the inside to make the nice cozy spot for your tent. Next, I'm going to show you a video of the second way that you can make the fort. Remember here that you can also use the clothes rope that I used for the first way to make the fort. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you guys like these types of videos, please let me know and I can make more. If you decide to try it out, um, don't forget to share your pictures and your creations on Google Classroom with us. Until next time, please stay safe, wash your hands, and do your homework. Bye!